I'm a big fan of the museum, but after I built it, I realized I was going to have to switch some stuff up. So one of the obvious switch ups all over my city that I do is just take out general normal city minifigures and put, you know, Vision, a Stormtrooper, you know, Death Eater, Nick Fury, you know, et cetera, et cetera. I just like to have that type of flavor in my city. And, you know, the city just looks cool, but I, people that know about these things and they're kind of nerds in their own right, they get a whole new kick out of the museum. Starting with the statue that they gave us, I switched it up with the Zane statue from Ninjago that I had in uh, Ninjago City Gardens. All right, let's go ahead and go inside the museum starting with the gift shop. So I made some changes to the gift shop as well. You can see some Lego sets uh, there in the back that they're selling. We got the Girth Gang here getting ready to buy a box of boys. And we also got the Quibbler for sale back there. A little something from Harry Potter. You can also see they also sell uh, holograms that are on the desk there and even some blue milk. So here is a better look at the sets they got on sale and the Quibbler. Also, to the right here, we have the shield with the tree from Gondor from Lord of the Rings. Thought that was a nice touch. To the left of the gift shop, here we have Indiana Jones hat and a scarab from Marvel. Over here, we have the one ring to rule them all. And sitting over here, we have the Infinity Gauntlet with all these infinity stones. On the wall there, I put that sign, notice camera in use just to make sure nobody steals anything. And next to that, I have the Chicago flag because my favorite convention is Brick World Chicago. Moving to the right of the gift shop, you can see an array of other things over here. Uh, starting with the Monster Book of Monsters and a Tron identity disc. To the right of that, you can see a Sentinel head. Back here we have the mirror mirror on the wall, who is the fairest of them all. Ironically, it's not even on a wall. Uh, I decided to take out the dinosaur and put the AT-AT, -AT, and please Star Wars fans, tell me which one that is. Uh, I cannot remember for the life of me, but it just looked better, sorry. And in front of the AT-AT, -AT, you can see a uh, Jar Jar Binks frozen in carbonite. We do love those uh, bounty carbonites. And the last thing that I put in this room was the Mandalorian cell that they contained Darth Maul in. I just thought that was something very unique and very awesome to go ahead and put in the museum. I'm telling you, man, this museum's got some cool stuff in it. Moving up to the second floor, um, I put the VIP sign there. I just thought it would look kind of good and it actually fit perfectly. It just really stands out. Uh, you can see here next to it I got the yellow lantern and I just thought that was something really cool it's spaced theme so you know thought I'd look it up here so moving over to the left here you can see a ray gun on the wall there I just kind of act like it might have be uh, Rick Sanchez's from Rick and Morty and you can see Darth Revan there checking out a Sith holocron very nice very nice all right, moving over to the right side, you can see the Imperial logo uh, mounted on the wall there. I just thought that was great. Another Bounty Carbonite, you can see. Very good stuff. And this one is Salacious Crumb. I decided just to switch up all these helmets that were on the, um, and put all these helmets on the wall. So you can see just different helmets, not just Star Wars. You can see Loki from Marvel, uh, Flash from DC. Nothing too different going on in the back. You can see uh, the old style uh, hand Solo and Carbonite back there. Got some hooligans. Got a couple Jawas stealing some artwork. I uh, got Pink Wheel's uh, mech sitting over there. And you know, the ghost just parked wherever it wants. And you know, you got Monkey King mech with a cup of coffee. Yeah, it's life in a big city. Thank you so much everybody for watching. I appreciate it very much. Stay safe out there.